All right, it's time for Royal Royal Articulate Phrases. Raps, respectfully addressing people's spirits and soul. That's what the S stands for, spirit or soul. And soul. Does he really love you? Yeah, without a doubt. Why not? Respect the brother. He already knows you don't like being smothered. It makes me wonder, is there another? Let the brother know because he tells everyone I love her. Oh, man, don't get me started with that right there. I do have a video for that song. Check this out right here. Oh, I love this. Getting my own thoughts under control should be my goal. Not me trying to get others to fit into my mold. By the way, that's not what I'm doing with these videos. <laughs> Getting my own thoughts under control should be my goal. Not me trying to get others to fit in my mold. Let me explain that. If I'm focused on controlling my thoughts, getting my thoughts up under control, then I'm not going to be worried about trying to get others to fit my mold. I'm not going to even be focused on that. That should be my goal. One of my goals to get my thoughts under control. And if I'm focused on that, I won't try and get others to fit into my mold. I'll be too busy focusing on getting my thoughts under control so that I can control myself and my life and not other people's life. That's not love trying to control other people. That's not love at all. As a matter of fact, it's evil. Yah doesn't control people, so why should I? He doesn't make anybody do anything. He gave us a free will. He gave us the choice. We can choose him or we can choose somebody else or we can choose whatever we want. With consequences, of course. With consequences. It's not retarded to diligently keep your heart guarded. So if someone say it is disregarded in a loving way, <laughs> love is not rude. It's not retarded to diligently keep your heart, mind guarded. So if someone say it is, Disregard it, disregard it without being rude, disregard it, throw it away. In other words, it's not stupid or goofy to me to guard my mind through renewing it with the word of Yah, doing what 2 Corinthians chapter 3, verse 5 through 10 says, where it says, the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through God to the pulling Pulling down strongholds, casting down imaginations in every, somebody say every, every high thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of God, the knowledge of Yah. The knowledge of God is the word of God, the Bible. So, you know, if somebody come to me and say, for you to keep your mind guarded or your heart guarded is retarded, is crazy, is stupid. I'm going to disregard that foolishness in a loving way. I'm going to ignore it or I'm going to excuse myself from them or I'm going to change the subject. Because it's not retarded to keep my mind guarded. It's not retarded. It's very wise. It'll keep me out of a whole lot of trouble. It'll keep me at peace. When I keep my mind or my heart guarded. 
through the word of Yah. Through doing what 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 3 through 5 says, specifically, or oh, Philippians chapter 4, 8. You know, I don't know the whole scripture by heart, but it starts out with, hmm, what is that? Whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is peaceable, you know, all that godly stuff, think on this. Think on those things. That's another way that you keep your mind and your heart guarded. Philippians 4 8. Yes. All right. The signs are there. Are you aware? If so, prepare. Or is it you just don't care? The signs are there. Are you aware? If so, prepare. Or is it you just don't care? In other words, I'm going to talk about myself. I saw the signs. I saw the red flags in this situation, this relationship. I was aware. And I didn't prepare. I ignored the red flags. I ignored the signs for different reasons. One reason is because I wanted companionship. I wanted companionship, yes, which there's nothing wrong with that, in my opinion. I just have to make sure I have companionship and friendship with the right people, the right woman, for me. I didn't prepare. I didn't do the things that I know is right for me. I didn't guard my mind. I chose not to guard my mind. So I ignored the signs. <laughs> I ignored them. And I didn't care. As stupid as that sound at the time, I did not care about ignoring the signs and not guarding my mind. I didn't care about doing that. Because I wanted the friendship and the companionship. But I thank the most high that I, I got up out of that situation with his the power of his spirit. And I'm walking and talking with him again. Boy, I just want to rhyme. I'm walking and talking with him again because he's my best friend. <laughs> yes, he is. Yes, you are, Lord. Bless you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Now I care. I care about myself. I definitely care about others. But I care about myself a whole lot more. And I won't ignore the signs. And through the grace of Yehoshua, by the grace of Yehoshua, through faith, I will not ignore the signs. Well, until next time, y'all have a blessed one. Peace. Rural articulate phrases. Where my music at? No other denies. You have a prize. And this man ain't no ordinary guy. Stop treating him like someone from your past. If you really want your relationship to last. I forgot the words. Peace.